the city. Oh, just drop it off at the Waldorf garage. The Waldorf Astoria? Bet you can't say that three times fast without making a mistake. Look, bud, I've had all of you I can take. I gotta watch my blood pressure. So long. Oh, now, wait a minute. Kiss me goodbye, my sweet, for we shall never see each other again. Oh, yes, we will, honey. I've got a bad habit of looking at the dummies in department store windows. license. So what's the idea? I was only doing 25. Hand over the driver's license. Well, I would if I had one. Got an owner's certificate? Look, officer, what have I done? You started out kind of friendly. You got something against people from South Brooklyn? Where'd you get this car? I borrowed it. Is that a crime? Oh, so you borrowed it. Who from? From the fellow who owns it. Or at least he said it was his. What's his name? Well, I don't know. We weren't formally introduced. And what's your name, sister? I go by Maisie Revere, but my right name's Mary Anastasia O'Connor. Oh, an alias. Well, car thieves are getting better looking every day. And you certainly didn't pick yourself a cheap one either, but one that costs plenty of dough. One of the Ralston's cars. That's where you made your mistake, sister. Why, every cop on the pipe from here to Montauk Point knows the Ralston's cars. You come on with me. Oh, now, look, officer, you got this all wrong. Let me explain how it happened. You can tell it to the judge in the morning. Now, come on. Am I to understand I'm under arrest? Yes. You know, there was a pinhead worked at the carnival with me. Funny. He never said anything about having a son on the police force. But I guess he had his pride, same as anybody else. It seems to me I deserve some consideration around here on account of my uncle Denny, a good cop with a wonderful record. He never made me false arrests. 